Hey everyone, this is Linnea Lucan with the Heartland Institute here with another climate fact check. Today, I'm going to look at the claim that Antarctica is melting away dangerously due to climate change and will cause massive sea level rise. Although Antarctica has seen some ice melt in some locations, the data paint a more reassuring picture. The media claims that Antarctica is losing ice six or more times faster than it was a few decades ago. But Antarctica was barely losing ice back then, and it still is barely losing ice compared to its overall ice mass. Some satellite measurements estimate that the total ice loss each year from Antarctica is three ten thousandths of one percent of the continent's ice mass. That's not much. The truth is, it is unclear if Antarctica is losing any ice on balance or if it's currently experiencing a net gain. It gets even more complicated when you factor in warming trends in Antarctica. There is a question of how much, if any, the continent has even seen overall. NASA satellite data shows no net warming at all, basically a flat trend since 1978. And when you plot temperature station data from across Antarctica, it actually looks like the continent has been cooling since the 1990s. One recent study published in Nature Climate Change shows that most warming and melting in Antarctica is occurring in a single location, the West Antarctic Ice Sheet, specifically the Antarctic Peninsula. The research indicates that the majority of that melt is from sea ice due to ocean currents bringing relatively warmer water rather than rising air temperatures. While there is also land-based ice melt in West Antarctica, it has been counterbalanced by ice mass gains in the interior of the continent. In 2015, NASA reported that the Antarctic ice sheet had a net gain of 82 to 112 billion tons of ice per year, up until at least 2008. NASA's research was confirmed in a 2023 study published in the journal Cryosphere from the European Geosciences Union, which found that in the decade between 2009 and 2019, Antarctic ice shelves increased by more than 5,305 square kilometers on balance. This isn't even getting into the weeds on recent research that suggests subsurface volcanic activity might be responsible for warming the waters around West Antarctica's misnamed Doomsday Glacier. Antarctica and its ice balance is a massively complex system, with the best evidence showing absolutely no cause for concern. That's all I have for this fact check. For the sources used as reference for this video, you can check out climateataglance.com, where you can also download a free copy of the book Climate at a Glance for Teachers and Students. If you prefer paper, you can purchase a hard copy on Amazon. We also have an app available called Climate at a Glance for Android and iPhone. Thanks for watching.